Oh yeah, sexy biscuits. Nice. This is Lego Batman 3 Beyond Gotham. Um, it's Christmas Day. I don't know what day it is when you get to watch this, but yeah, this is what Mummy and Daddy Lawn Boy got me for Christmas. This and a stamp I can push up on bread, and then when it toasts, I get to see the Marmite logo. Now, it was released this year. It was released on the PS Vita, PlayStation 3, PlayStation 4, X-Bone, Xbox um, 360, Windows. Oh, I don't know if bats can swim. Oh. Oh my god, it's Batman. Um, yeah, based upon the loading screen uh, and all the licenses that appear within it, there's a bunch of shit licensed from the original 60s TV show. Possibly because it finally got released on Blu-ray and it was a really big deal. The reason you never saw it uh, you know, on DVD before now, oh, sorry, I just pissed off that you let Jason Todd die and I'm wondering if you're going to do the same thing to me. So that's a reference for the comic guys. Um, yeah, and it was a really big deal for it to come out. So. As far as I can tell, all the surviving members of the cast voice this in some way or other, which means hopefully we get to see Adam West. Right. Your, your basic attack boy fucking wonder is getting on my nerves. Right. Now, it's funny, right, because I like, I, well, I love Lego, you know, games where they do the movies, but not all of them. Um, Indiana Jones, the original, is my favourite. That's an absolute boss game. I, I got so close to completing everything in that. Um, I love the uh, complete Star Wars trilogy, the, you know, the prequels and the original that was on the Wii. Um, I hated Harry Potter. I love The Hobbit. Right, hang on. But yeah, they're not everyone's cup of tea. They're very linear. They're basically grinders. I mean, if, you like, if you're completionist, then get ready to waste a lot of your life. But the reason I wanted this one, because I hated the original, Batman Lego that is, but right, that's <laughs> fucking boy, you're a man's job. Um, but... The reason I wanted this because I like the second, and this is uh, the, the story is epic. Um, obviously, released by Telltale Games. Um, it's uh, is it a Brainiac comes to Earth and he brainwashes everyone in the uh, Lantern Corps uh, and he gets all the rings and he needs one final ring. I think he gets to me eventually, Batman. But this is like a prequel. Look. This is a tutorial, so don't expect to see much. I'm going to do a little bit of it because I want you to see if you don't know what it looks like on the 360, what it looks like, but. Yeah, so he comes to Earth to get Howell Jordan's ring, obviously, he's the Green Lantern, right, so... Yeah, grinder, as I say, proper, proper grinder, you know. Good balance of puzzles, because obviously it's aimed at, you know, universal audience, sort of like, um... Kids, sort of like, um, but no, kids and adults. Oh, so all the, the, the funny coloured bricks are in shopping trolleys, or carts, if you're North American. Don't know what they're called, Nolls or New Zealand. But yeah, graphically, you know, it looks really, really nice, but there's only so much you can do. Um, but yeah, oh, uh, I will say this about the loading screen. Am I the only person who misses the original DC Comics, you know, logo in the top left hand corner, like you used to get with Marvel Comics and stuff when it used to be the upside down bullet, and everyone they've done since has been shite. Right, there we go. Right, now you get to unlock, once you earn them, various suits. You can, you can see my money above my, my hearts in the top left hand corner. Money will appear. Uh, there's a bar in the middle as well, which is what you need to complete, because you've got to basically grind and get as much cash as you can um, <clears throat> to get like the red blocks or something. It's been a while since I've played a Lego game. Right, but you build. I love that noise. That noise is epic. Now, I've got the sound quite low because Warner Bros. in DC are absolute bastards for copyright, and it's playing the Batman Tim Burton um, original movie music right now, which is my favourite Batman and Michael Keaton is my favourite Batman. Right, so um B No it's not saying B, so I gotta I like the way you change between characters. And this is why I wanted it, because say so hold it down or you tap it to change. Holding it down makes you go into your suits, and I've got the hazard suit. But yeah, I just wanna be able to play as the flash. Check it out, I'm fucking Ghostbusters. Hey, wouldn't Ghostbusters Lego be amazing? Right, so we built this tank. And I got a proton pack that sucks. Right. Much like the third one we'll do when it finally comes out. Actually, that's not fair, Dave. Hold, you know, tight on that one. 
I still think it's going to be shit. I don't think something should be remade. Oh, I can fire shit. Oh, it really is Ghostbusters 2. Oh, sorry, boss, but you know, like I said, Jason Todd and shit. Right, so. Boom. Right, do, do, do you have to sound like you're enjoying that so much? Which one am I? I get confused. So, Jason Todd. I'm Tim Drake. Am I Tim Drake? Is it Tim Drake? My least favourite Robin. Burt Ward was the best. Yeah, right. Get the money, get the money, get the money, get the money. Although, ironically, even though it's a Lego game, why would I need money on Bruce Well, and Bruce Wayne's fucking child prodigy, but why would I need money on Bruce Wayne? Always wondered this. Yeah, poking holes in the franchise. You know, Batman prides himself on protecting the innocent and never putting anyone at risk. He's got this anti-killing code, even though he's a brutal bastard. But, oh, you missed some, boy wonder. Sort your fucking vacuum out. Or sort your sucking out. Right, there we go. Ow, oh, don't fucking hit me. Well, I'm going to slap you. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, why, why does he... Like, take a kid into fucking combat. Right, so pulling on the uh, the gas powered bat gun to shoot shit at the wall. There we go. Broken the wall, broken the wall, breaking the law, breaking the law. Right, now, as I said, this is because everything in this game is dependent upon the different suits. In the Star Wars game, you had force powers and stuff like that, but in this game, it's all about the bat suit. So, where's Batmite? No, no, I've got to punch it. Oh, I've got a new suit. I've got a new suit. Yeah, I need that eye. Yeah, because like I said, it's tutorial. Right, but anyway, punch. Yeah, he's Batman. I would have preferred Batfink. And I also remember Batfink. Batfink was epic, right? So my suit can do shit, and there's a green sparkly thing, and I'm not a Jedi, and I've got Spider Sense. So many franchises being ripped off here. That's really cool. Oh my god, I'm Frank Miller. So shit's behind that wall, right? Hammer time, hammer time, hammer time, hammer time. Sweet. Get the money, get the money, get the money. Oh my god, I'm no longer Bruce Wayne. I'm fucking Scrooge McDuck. Right, so. And again. No, that doesn't work. Oh, we do it there. So, some sort of thing behind this wall. What's that? That's water. Sorry, people, it's the first time I've played it. And, oh, I can turn the pipes. I am a Jedi then, right? <clears throat> Not sure what you do, but you don't appear to be useful. Right, now do I, do I catch the pigeon? Oh, why didn't I invert the controls? Open a valve. Yay, I'm Batman. Right, I don't know why you would hide that in the sewers, or possibly, I don't know, maybe let's have a public services justify their budget. Blue chip, gee, blue chips, not poker. Ah, oh, most valuable. Get that. Get that. Boom. Sonic old toilet. At the urge to quote, strange urge to quote Austin Powers right now, which is, well, I want a solid old toilet, by the way, it's just not on the cards, is it? Can't destroy that yet, but I, I'm assuming, like I said, if you're a completionist, that means I've got some purpose or point to go back with, with all the unlocked characters later on and chisel away to get, you know, a hundred percent. Alright, there we go. No, no, just change because I see slime and ooze, and I'm assuming this is the suit that Geldof was his Christmas uh, single for because we need it. Even though you're really shit at fucking breaking stuff, Robin. Thank you. Can I call you Robin? I was going to call you Boy Failure or oh, least favourite assistant ever. Well, at least you're no super boy. Right, so I can't progress that way because I'm assuming my hazard suit's not made of Kevlar. Ooh. Right, so go this way. Oh, it does protect me, Batman. Right, I'm assuming that's what Batfink, Batman, whatever the fucking his weird name was, is telling me. I do remember from the 60s, not 60s, or the 70s cartoon where there was, there was a couple of epics, you know, Batman cartoons and shit. Right. Oh, yeah. Breaking the law, breaking the law. Come on. No. Oh, I can change between quick change. No. Change. Thank you. Alright. Oh, oh, I can target. Sweet. Oh, that's quite useful. I can actually properly target. Not that one. I want that one. You're a really shit shot, boy wonder. Thank you. Right, coins, smashy smashy. Because obviously that blue shit over there, or blue shit, green shit means we need to go over there. But uh, in order to do that, I'm assuming I've got to get up there. 
So you smash everything and if it floats around like this, you know the deal with Lego games. If it floats around like this and shit, it means I can build, build a better burger and shit, right? There we go. Yes. You taught me well, master. Oh, again, sorry, wrong franchise. And so the ladder comes down. Well, the penny drops, if you will. As I said, it's just tutorial level, because ordinarily there will be, you know, levels where you have to fight the bad guys as well, and you get money and shit off them, too. Right, so I've got to get Batman across, over not Because even though he's the world's greatest detective, apparently he doesn't know how to find a way for himself. And he's relying on me. Ooh. Right. More slime. Don't, don't fucking get in it. Unless you want to animate a toaster or the Statue of Liberty. Again, Lego Ghostbusters, please, please, please. Right, anyway, stop collecting coins, David. It's gameplay. We just want to show stuff, right? Ah, I turn, I turn. There we go. All right, only turn one on. Nice run, right? So I still got my 3D shit on and everything. Up here, up here, up here, up here. That works. That works. Oh, back on. That probably looks terrible because obviously I'm filming it because I'm cheap and I can't be asked to use my capture card. Down here, floaty noises. Right, so back to back. I'm in the right suit, so B. There we go. Right, so that is really cool. So there's some in there. So fire. Apparently, I'm as strong as Superman right now. I'm kind of curious how the free Lego figure that came with this, because it's a limited edition pack, um, had the Superman or uh, well Clark Kent figure where he's opening his shirt and you can see the Superman logo and not. A Batman figure because even though it's beyond Metropolis, it's um, can I not get in the train? Um, it's, it's a fucking Batman game, right? Screw it, even doubt, just fucking change, and then they always find a way to get up. Don't ask me how it works, so you can smash shit, stuff like that, Hulk smash, and all that cool goodness, right? But leg it, leg it, leg it, leg it. And to the next section. Right, oh. Go up there. And go and shit. Alright. I don't know where Batman is, but he can fucking stay there. Oh, water. That's kind of nice. Now I'm assuming there's a suit, because as you can see before, I like that flame effect, I could swim down. I wonder what the difference is between this and the X-Bone version. Oh, shark. Where's my shark repellent sp spray for my helicopter that makes him blow up? Sorry. I was just going to say, you sound it familiar. It's Mayor West. Epic beans. Oh, run away from the shark. Anyway, I'm going to call it quits there. Probably the wrong level to play, but it's Christmas Day and I just want to ha have a crack at Mummy and Daddy Longboy's present. And, um, yeah, show you what it looks like. But I'm probably going to go massively completist on this and waste an entire chunk of my life pointlessly. But, yeah, Lego Batman 3 on the Xbox 360. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you later. Sorry, that was really kind of creepy. That was my Batman gruff voice. Anyway, bye!